So, it's 2014 p.m. It's Thursday evening, and I got some shit to get off my chest. So, <clears throat> if you don't know me by now, if you just come across this because it was recommended and shit, I implore you to go back and watch the beginning of this playlist so you understand me properly. Oh my. So, why am I doing this video? I just found out a classmate of mine died. Now, am I upset? Yeah. Am I mad? No. I'm perplexed. Because I've known her... Her name's Jessica Cooper, by the way. I've known her since high school, give or take. Maybe middle school. But, like, surface, no. Like, there's levels to knowing somebody. There's surface level. There's... Mid level, and then there's deep ass fucking Mariana Trench levels. So I knew her from the surface. You know, we had little, we say hi to each other, that kind of shit. But I'm just like perplexed by this because I didn't know she died. Because I saw her obit, I saw her obituary in the paper tonight while I was cutting stuff out. I scrapbooked too. Fun stuff. Um. And I saw her, I was like, no fucking way. So I looked it up on Facebook. Son of a bitch, she died. Yeah. Left behind her kids and her husband. And I'm sitting here, and I'm thinking like, damn. When I was at my window, thinking about this, I'm like, you know, why does the Reaper do this shit? You know, like, is there a reason? You know, like, you know why? I don't know if she did drugs or she did alcohol. I don't know. I have no clue what the hell the cause of death was. But I'll probably find out from one of my friends once I ask her what's going on. Um, but, yeah. I'm just like, why does the Reaper take so quickly and suddenly? And without warning. That's the, word. That's the funny, that's the fucked up part. And then, I'm thinking about it from another perspective. Like, what if this is a design? What if this was all planned that she's supposed to die at 34 so him and the kids can find someone better? I know that sounds fucked up and it's wrong, but that's how I think. You know, I'm outside of the box with my thoughts. And then I think about my whole graduating class and I think about, you know, most of us are in our mid-30s. And it'll be a goddamn miracle if any of us make it to 40 without dying. <laughs> Christ. Oh, it's so fucked up. It just, it really is. Like, so many people I've known are dead now. Like, I was talking to um, one of my old friends. Actually, two different friends. Uh, the bartender at Spargo's, Brandon, who is awesome as fuck. I love him. He's a great fucking guy. And then I was talking to Amanda Matthews. And she just, you know, friend requested me out of nowhere. I was talking to Brandon because I asked him, because the power blinked out last night. So um, I asked him if he charged his phone up and make sure, you know, he's got it charged in case the power goes out. He's like, yeah, I did. Cool. So, then, hours later, Amanda friend requested me. I'm like, I haven't seen her ass in, de in a decade. <laughs> and then we've been catching up. So, yeah, it's just weird. Everybody coming back and leaving. I'm like, okay. <laughs> like, <sighs> it's just so strange. I'm like, you know, are we going to make it to 40? <laughs> It's really weird. Like, I've seen so many people come and fucking go. And I couldn't remember Amanda's first boyfriend. So I'm looking through my sophomore yearbook. And man, I'm looking at most of the picture. I'm like, damn, he's dead. She's dead. She's locked up. He's locked up. They're married. They have kids. And it's so weird. So many of us are dead. Before we, even, we either hit 30. Because some of them died before 30. And then others died just after 30. And I'm like, are we going to make it? <laughs> it's just so weird. It's one of them thoughts that's in my head, in the very back of my head.
that I don't pay attention to unless something triggers it or, you know, pokes at it like somebody poking the damn bear. I was like, ah, oh, it's a great fucking day. He's like, are we gonna make it? The fuck you doing pissing me off like that? Stop. <laughs> but yeah, like, who else died this year? Anne McLean Blevin, Blevins died. Um, I think that was it. Somebody else might have too. I don't remember. But yeah, like, it just, it hits home and I'm like, fuck. <sighs> Like, why? <laughs> and we'll never know why. We'll know the surface reason of why. Whether it was, you know, drugs, alcohol, suicide, or, you know, random heart condition, or what the fuck ever. But we'll never know the metaphysical question of why. We'll never know the spiritual question of why. That's what's annoying. Like, why, Reaper, why? You know? So, yeah. Then I'm pissed. But not pissed, pissed. Like, there's levels to pissed. I've mentioned this before. My pissed off level right now is like. If I had to rank it at 10, 1 being eh, 10 being like, you're gonna fucking die. I'd say I'm about like 2.5. And, and just. It's a perplexed pissed. It's like, fuck! How? Why? Tell me. I need to know. Ugh. So, yeah. Ugh. So, yeah. That's where I'm at. I'm just. I'm not sad. I'm just like, kind of crestfallen in a sense over this. So. Yeah. So. That's where I'm at. I just wanted to get this off my fucking chest before I do my movie reviews. Because I had the original intention of just jumping into reviews. I'm like, no. I need to do this video, get the shit off my chest before I go into doing a review and then going over what the fuck's wrong and then I'll waste all that time. So, that's where I'm at. So, I'm going to upload this motherfucker and then we're going to do some movie reviews. So, stay tuned. And eventually, this will pass. This issue I have will pass, so don't worry, I'll be alright.